okay so hello and welcome back uh, so i actually got uh, the api key when you go to the dashboard once you have login i got the api key but only problem is actually i i have in mind that uh, i can explain the country's details uh, but only problem is they have made it as a paid one okay when you go to the payment uh, uh, section or api usage now i guess somewhere in account no 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 subscription plan yep so when you see the subscription so they made actually a paid one okay so for free uh, they are only giving a limited support and limited number of uh, searches and limited data as well because when i search with this particular url when i copy because i have to make it clear so when i search with this particular url i got data but thing is not full data only the few amount of data and which does not contains any countries um, the currency and flag and all are they are not there only just a basic level of information is there because we don't have subscription we are not have a paid subscription for that okay only few amount of data and also when i make this as https so they are not allowing https url okay subscription does not supports okay so you need to subscribe and you have to pay the amount for that so i don't wanted to do that uh, simply because of this example so i will take out back here uh anyway we have a country uh, instead of ca countries we have a contact tab as uh, last example right so why can't you take the contact tab uh, details only so only one change here is it's not country details it's a contact details country list will have a contact list okay that's my plan so let me uh, refactor everything to contact list okay and this will be but inside you have country only uh, one thing is you can delete them and you can create a new one in here you are not doing anything right okay delete so i go to components i create uh, i'm i'm very sorry for this yep so nggc contactless instead of country list is contactless next one more contact details okay fine and what about the service service also you delete these two go to services open in terminal let's say nggs uh, contact for contact service okay done anything else uh, for model i'll say rename as contact okay back to original and one thing which is there the nav bar it's not countries it's a uh, contacts and uh, this is also contacts okay and what about the uh, home page component i mean the routing i'll say contacts contact list component and we don't have anything called uh, country list component done and go to app module and re remove the existing uh, country kind of country list country details we don't have now okay these two are not there okay it's back to original now you don't have any problem i guess so for safe side i'll restart or let's check now itself okay looks good the contact list yeah home page is there contacts and about fine so now let's focus on a contacts to display all the contacts and when i click on a particular contact so that contact to be displayed on next page okay let's focus on this now uh, so first of all you need to have a uh, contacts services right so this should be getting the contacts details 
but this we already done right in the last example so why you have to worry about creation and all so let me get it from the previous example because uh, the last example we made it so let's go to app models the contact model I'll copy go to contact I'll paste it this is a contact model which we discuss and then um, back here services yeah we discussed the contact service let's copy as it is everything and uh, our contact service replace here okay so to getting all the contacts okay that's fine now um, okay so service ready and model is ready so let's move on to contactless HTML so let's make something here so container one row single column so let's say some margin top 3 I say p dot h3 contactless uh, you say something called text danger let's say a paragraph lorem 30 tab now check you get a contactless so home page contactless about page that's fine so contactless I need to have all the list of contacts there is no partition here just all the list of contacts in a table format here okay so let's quickly make a table format of it so one more container okay so let's say margin top three mm, let's say one row single column and let's take a table okay I need to have a table with a class table table hover uh, table striped and text center t head t table row t h star six tab serial number name name of the person age of the person and uh, email of the person location of the person and also I need to have a photo of the person okay so you can cut this you keep it before okay that's fine yeah I need to have a T head and the class called BG dark and text uh, white okay and, and to have all the details so let's say here T body I need to have a data but where do we have a data is you go to contactless component and here you have to get data from the service so let's create a variable first so let's say public contacts of type contact array is equal to an empty array as contact array and public error message of type string or undefined that's enough so let's inject my service to a private contact service of type contact uh, service so here I'll say this dot contact service dot get all contacts dot subscribe here here you have a data of all the contacts so let's do this dot contacts is equal to uh, sorry it's data okay comma another function for error so let's have error so this dot this dot error message is equal to error okay then so now you got all the contacts so let's loop through all the contacts and display on my HTML here so let's say table row uh, loop through so star uh, ng4 let contact of contacts okay so let's say table data I just write uh, contact dot login dot uuid so 
you get all the UUIDs, but I need a substring uh, contact dot login dot UUID dot length minus y. So last y characters. Okay, photo. Uh, you can display a photo uh, using an image tag. Uh, let's write SRC property binding that is contact dot picture dot large and let's give the class no no i think alternate text empty you got images okay and uh, what else in td let's make uh, a small image i guess with uh, some 50 and the height uh, also 50 okay that's fine and name age so name uh, name you know right um, contact dot name dot first and also contact dot name dot last okay you got a name then uh, you need to have uh, contact dot dob dot age and some years okay and email uh, email is contact dot email directly okay and lastly the location let's say tda contact dot location actually a uh, object dot city okay that's fine <coughs> now see home page contacts page about page got it fine now this is fine uh, what is my plan is when I click on a particular person so that particular data I wanted to send to another page and where I have to display that okay so for example for example you know one uh, REST API right uh, I'll show you there is something called uh, um, fake REST API there is one mocking yeah json placeholder yeah in json placeholder website you can go with user see here slash users you get all the users right so when i say users slash one you get one person data so when i say slash two second person data correct if you don't make anything just say all users you get all the users same way here if i say slash contacts all the contacts has come and when i say slash a particular id so only that particular person data should come okay so how you make that and how you configure the id okay so till now we have configured uh, where we configured in the routing module so we have configured just static routes okay these are all just static so i want to make some ideas dynamic because each person will have a unique id okay and you can't configure all ids here okay you have to make something dynamic okay so let's see how to handle the dynamic routing in the next video right thanks